What's up, Mac gamers? Y'all jokers are heading to Night City. Cyberpunk 2077 is heading to Apple Silicon Max early next year. This will mark the first time the dystopian, high-octane game drops on macOS. And it's all thanks to Apple's ongoing innovation with its custom processors, including the M1, M2, and the newly introduced M3 chips. We've seen a number of AAA titles come to macOS this year, like Resident Evil, Hades 2, and even Lies of P. But if I'm being honest, I'm a little shocked that Cyberpunk 2077 is coming to Mac. I hope my Mac Mini can handle it, and it doesn't get turned into a crispy critter. However, it seems as if this could be an ideal match, a CD Projekt Red plans to harness Apple's advanced graphics technology. The game will take full advantage of Apple's metal framework, which optimizes games for Apple's architecture, supporting next-gen features like path tracing, which simulates realistic light paths, and frame generation for smoother graphics rendering. Also, special attention is being made for those that game with headphones adding built-in spatial audio support. If you ever played something with quality audio support, it can feel like the sound is doing sweet, naughty things to your ears. So this is for sure an added benefit. I'm curious to see how this performs sales-wise and how does it run on the various Silicon Series devices, especially laptops. The Mac version is also coming to Steam so if you have it on Steam, you're good to go. No need to buy it again and double dip. Let us know your thoughts on if it will sell well and your overall expectations. Hit that subscribe button and stick around as we give it a test run once that bad boy drops. That's it.